सो हे गाइस वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल एंड इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट अमृता विश्वविद्यालय पीटम व्हिच इज आल्सो नोन एज अमृता कॉलेज ऑफ इंजीनियरिंग आई एम गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट एवरीथिंग अबाउट दिस कॉलेज द प्लेसमेंट द एडमिशन प्रोसीजर द काउंसलिंग प्रोसीजर द कट ऑफ्स ऑफ ब्रांचेस एंड द फीस स्ट्रक्चर एंड हाउ इज द लाइफ इन दिस कॉलेज एंड एट लास्ट आई एम गोइंग टू गिव यू द फाइनल वर्डिक्ट अबाउट दिस कॉलेज सो या इफ यू वांट टू नो अबाउट दिस कॉलेज जस्ट स्टिक टिल द एंड ऑफ दिस वीडियो एंड नाउ विदाउट एनी फर्दर यू लेट्स स्टार्ट दिस वीडियो So yeah, guys, Amrita Vishwa Vidya Pitham or Amrita College of Engineering. It holds the 20th rank in engineering in NIRF, which is a very big thing, and it also have a great accreditation from NAC. So these two things are not a little thing. This shows that yeah, this college have potential in engineering. So without any further delay, let's see what are the programs they are offering in all the campuses of them. Okay. <laughs> So as you can see, the main campus which is Coimbatore, it consists of almost every courses except the electronics and computer engineering. And uh, you can see the courses are aerospace engineering, automation and robotics engineering, chemical engineering, civil engineering, computer and communication engineering, computer science and engineering, and its specializations and ECE, triple E. And there are many many courses. You can come to this site. I will give the link of every site I am opening in this video. in description and i'm also going to give you the contact number of admission and everything you need okay so yeah you can just come to this page and you can just see what are the courses running in which campus here all four campus status is given okay so you can see that and now let's talk about how is the admission procedure of this college so at first i'd like to just say you if you just only give je mains if you didn't get a triple e which is the examination of this amrita uh, university so the last date for you is august 15 you can see here the last date to apply with je mains 2021 score is august 15 2021 okay so you can come to this page and you can go and apply i'll also give you the this uh, application site uh, link in the description you can just click that and go and apply because there is only two days left okay so yeah now let's see what are the eligibility criteria so yeah the eligibility criteria is like uh, the student have a total of 55% more than 55% and in pca more than 60% this is the normal the normal eligibility criteria and there are many management quota is are also for nir students and all and uh, now let's see the admission modes of admission the modes of admissions are very very much the first one is a a triple e sorry a triple e which is its own examination and j means 2021 sat score pu double e score so and management quota also they have okay so these are there are many modes for admission so if you want to take in this college yeah you can try it okay So yeah, many of you are a little bit confused that how we are going to get admission, how is the eligibility guide, how the marks are going to be, how are the cutoffs and all. So yeah, let's. I am here. So yeah, I am here for you. I'll give you everything. Okay. So the first thing I would like to say that the twelve marks doesn't mean here. It's only for eligibility. Twelve marks is the need for the cutoff and all. The, the cutoffs are decided by J mains, A triple E, and all SAT and PSU score. Okay. So I'll want to just say you one thing. The A Triple A rank is published now. Okay, in twelfth August, which is today. So it is published. You can go and check out. I'll also give the link of checking this in the description. And with that, with that result, you are going to get the rank. And from rank, you will just know the cut off of you. So I'm going to now just rectify a few of your doubts that uh, some students who just only give J Mains, uh, which J Mains score they have to give. So for the admission, how many attempts you have given? the best one they will choose from that okay so you have to give the best jms score before the admission okay and this also go with same with a triple e rank and because there are three phases of exam so the best marks you have got in which phase they will just consider it and the candidates who just given a triple e and jms both so that would be little bit benefit for you if you are going to give in this two okay So, so, so that candidates are going to be a little bit benefit because they got little bit higher chances to get good branches. Okay, if you got good marks in both. So yeah, this is all little little doubts that a few students have. And uh, now let's see what are the cut off of this college. Okay. And before going to cut off, I'd like to tell you some important tip. 
that uh, in counseling the preference section would is there for example just uh, assume there is only one safe left in information technology and first student choose csc at first second dc and third at it and the second student choose the first preference as it csc and msc and both rank are just like similar so here the first student will not get the seat in it the second get student will get so this is how the preference work that the which course you have selected on the first you got more chances to take that according to your rank so yeah see the cut off according to your rank put the preference that which is the best subject for you in the top okay so this is the cut off of this college this is all our approx data these are all prediction from last years so don't even rely the days will change in 1 2k up down so yeah this is just for the idea that what you can get and i have done a lot of hard work for making this table for you all so yeah if you have any help from this video then go and please like it helps me it motivates me a lot for making more and more videos for you so now let's see i have given the all four campus cut off share i am going to talk about coimbatore only if you want you can see the pause the video and see okay in coimbatore in csc if you are home state the 14k rank <laughs> you are going to get csc that is a very big thing in other states 1.4 1.5k this is the approx value for ec 18k for home state 4k for other state for computer science with a specialization which is artificial intelligence yeah you will get uh, around 15k in home state and if you are from outside 2.2k it is around 2k 2.2k and in uh, in triple e it is a uh, 22k uh, from for home state and uh, for other states is 6k and uh, for mechanical it's a uh, 19.5k and for other states it is 6k 5.9k it is almost just similar to triple e and for civil it is 20k and uh, 6.5k for other states and at last i'm going to talk about the aerospace engineering because many of you asked in last video about the saas project how is the aerospace engineering cut off and all so i thought i'll just add this cut off also this is the type of main branches it comes also in main branches nowadays so aerospace they is the cut off is 5.2k sorry so in aerospace the cut off is 19k for the home state and 5.2k for other states so you can see i have given the cut off for other campuses also in which i just like to tell you one thing the worst campus is chennai and the best campus is coimbatore amrita puri and bangalore is are okay okay this is my review don't get offended okay this is just my opinion i'm just saying for you so yeah guys after this now let's talk about the placements of this college so in this college there are more than 200 companies came just like major companies like microsoft essencer google amazon these all came here so yeah this is a prestigious college that's why they are coming here okay and the placement percentage last year is among 95% which is a very huge thing the college having more than 90% in my opinion the college is good okay and every salary is 5.8 lakh for an m which is a good thing many private colleges have around 4 lakh only but yeah this is a college this proves that yeah this is a good college every salary is 5.8 lakh per annum and in computer science it goes around 8 lakh sometimes also 8 lakh 9 lakh so this is a very big thing okay for having every salary like that the highest salary which gone here is 56.95 ctc okay so this is a really good thing i'm just saying again and again but yeah the placement stats of this college are very good and now let's talk about the fees structure of this college so as you can see there are four slabs the slabs are like uh, yeah the percentage the rank you are getting under top 100 under 500 under top 500 rank under top 100 rank under top 10 rank so around that they will uh, just uh, divide the slabs and with that you will get the scholarship fees and this fees are only for first year okay from second year you have to maintain the rank in college also in semester exams you have to come in top 10 top 100 for getting a scholarship continued otherwise you will get disqualified from the scholarship and you will charge the regular fees okay so just uh, take that in your mind this fees is not for all four years this is for only first year okay so now let's see the fees the fees structure okay so it is around uh, it is for computer science and all you can see everything in this page i will give the link also 
but I am going to talk about computer science only. The fees is around 3 lakh for regular students and the students who got uh, scholarships in the third slab they got 2.5 lakh and the students uh, who got uh, this in second slab they will get 1.7 lakh and the students who are just like a topper who got a scholarship really good they will just charge only 3 lakh. Okay, so without a scholarship, if you just sum up, sum up the fees, it would be around 12 lakh for computer science and you can see other branches down here, okay. And yeah, one thing also, on, around the, the time of admission, they will charge you 10,000 for cost and deposit also and admission fees are also there, so they, they will add up and it will be like 3.5 lakh for the admission, I think, for, for regular candidates, okay. So yeah, this is all about the fees of this college. So yeah, with that, I'd like to conclude this video with the verdict that yeah, this Amrita Vesa with the Pit is a good college, really good college because it has the prestigious name, it has the ranking, it has the good percentage of placement, the good average salary, the highest salaries are also good, the placement, the companies who are coming here are really nice. I'd like to suggest that yeah, if you are getting computer campus, computer science, IT or ECE, you must go to this college if you are not getting IIT, okay. If you are getting IIT then that is no problem, okay, but if you, if you don't, just you can try this college, this is a good college, It uh, you will, this is a good college, you will not regret after going to this college and yeah. This is my verdict of this college. So yeah guys if you like this video just go down and like and if you got any help from this video please like the video and subscribe to my channel. If you have any queries go and comment down and if you want any any help from me come to my Instagram and I'll solve every of your doubt okay. And uh, yeah with that let's end this video. Thank you all for watching till the end and now let's meet you at the another video. Up till then bye bye.